Well, he hails from the Wyatt family, WWE royalty, and Eric Rowan wants a crowd of his own. Oh, man. Better have medical personnel on standby. I got a feeling we're going to need them. Mono a mono. One fall will decide it. Regardless, fans of the Wyatt family are here in force, ready to cheer Eric Rowan on. His back crashing into the ground. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Come on! Now he just wants that insult to injury. Yeah, this guy's a mean streak. What does Eric Rowan need to do to win tonight? Normally, he's standing in the same corner as his teammate, but tonight, he finds himself standing across from him. How would you navigate a matchup like this? Brothers fight, sisters fight, teammates fight. That's just the way it is. In the end, I'm sure everybody's gonna hug it out and move on. Man, oh man, on any other night of the week, they're teammates. But tonight, Michael, they battle to see who's the better man on their team. Contrary to popular thinking, I think this is a good thing. Competition makes everyone better. He catches him with the axe handle. I don't know if we have enough time in this broadcast to cover all the ways Eric Rowan is dangerous. For starters, Rowan has immeasurable strength and speed. You won't believe how Rowan moves for a man who stands six foot eight and weighs 315 pounds. Oh, and let's not forget, He's completely deranged. Well, I think you covered all the major ones, Cole. When you think about the size and speed Eric Rowan possesses, it's more than enough to get your attention. Then, add to that, the joy he gets from tearing people apart, and it's enough to make you consider a change in career path. We got a cover. And it's up. He got the shoulder up. After the amount of punishment he suffered, it's simply amazing that he's still in this one. Jerry, when we talk about Eric Rowan's speed, power, and yes, his twisted mind, the one thing we also need to mention is his toughness. It takes a ton of offense for an opposing superstar to bring Eric Rowan down, let alone keep him down. Nearly driven through the mat. Luke Harper starting to stumble now. We all know, though, this guy has plenty of fight left in him. Well, if he can't bounce back from this, then maybe he's not as tough as I thought he was. It's a good point, John. And I'd say he's really using his weight to his advantage here, reaching on the head and neck. You know, Michael, when I think of Eric Rowan, which I'd rather not, it's almost impossible for me to choose which of his weapons is the most dangerous. I will tell you this, when you combine that speed, power, toughness, and mental state, you get one scary individual. And one move after the other. It's devastating. This is hard to watch. This is going to be bad. Going for an encore here. Not a lot of spring left in his step right now. Boy, there's no way he's going to be able to stand after that. Boy, he was able to reverse it and get out of that. Luke Harper visibly losing steam. He'll need to find a way to turn things around here. Don't forget, he's executed his finisher twice already, which means his opponent probably has the move well scouted by now. And given the aggressive outpouring we've seen so far, I wouldn't be surprised if this one was over sooner than later. Oh, look at this! Eric Rowan doing some good work here. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Very, very painful hold here. What's he going to do? Oh, the longer he stays in this, the closer he is to losing the match. And his heartless attack continues. Oh, man. Watch it. And he powers out. I think this man needs business. Big Luke Harper. Wow, here we see it from this angle. He's going for the pen. This could be it. I think he's got him. Luke Harper gets the win in an impressive fashion.